All right. Welcome back to RPG Quest, and we are back to game 289 on the list, which is Sayuki Journey West on the PlayStation. How's it going, Zerodyne? How's it going, Madrino? How's it going, Tex? Welcome, welcome. Guess that bot is currently down. <laughs> no waifu for Tex. Wah, wah. So welcome back. Welcome back to more Sayuki. Pretty fun game so far. I mean, it's typical tactical RPG, but gorgeous art style on this one. I love the presentation. So, definitely enjoying it so far. For chapter two out of who knows how many chapters. My guess is like five or so. That's usually the, the standard for a lot of tactical RPGs. Gotta get to India. I mean, we technically left China in chapter one. Although, I guess China of this era probably wasn't China of now, so... I don't know. Are we in, like, Tibet now? <laughs> I don't know. Should we be making our way to India? Let's replay the introduction, the awesome intro, the, the awesome anime intro. <laughs> the male version of Sanko. Anime does rule. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I mean, looking at how big India or China is right now, and where we are, or where it looks like we are on the map, we'd still be in China of nowadays. So I don't know what this place was back, in, you know, when this when this thing took place. I mean, this is back in the, you know, way back in the old era, like whenever this this uh, fable came out in China. This whole journey to the West fable. I mean, this one's obviously very loosely based on it. Yeah, you, know, you have Goku and you have that pig dude. I forget his name is in the Chinese lore, but that's about it. <laughs> the characters are all like different. <laughs> Woman in the skirt, the the dragon lady. I forget her name. <laughs> it's been a couple days. I forget the name of all these characters. We we got the butterfly lady. We got the dragon lady. And of course, you know, Sanzo. We chose the female Sanzo. Alright. So I guess we're heading to Kucha. Did we go to Kucha? I don't know. I don't know if we even had a chance to visit the town. Oh yeah. <laughs> we did, because I, uh, I I spent a whole bunch of time uh, getting stuff at the, uh, at the post there, playing the cards. Good old card games. I think we got everything we wanted out of the card game, right? Yeah, we got everything we wanted out of it. <laughs> she can get my instant noodle. I'm sure there's gonna be another like gambling place later on. Let's see if there's any jobs we want to do here. Deliver salt, deliver letter. I want to delete some salt. Let's make a little bit of cash. We need some cash. Let's get some extra experience while we're at it. <coughs> Biku. I think I upgraded everybody's weapons, I think. I think I still some armor and stuff I'd want to buy, though. Oops. Yeah, everybody's maxed on their weapons. Good. So we got five... I think we still have one Guardian left to get. At least according to the manual. I don't know if there's more than that, but... Let's go to go Biku. Where's Biku? 
turn on the uh, analog here. Much easier with analog. <laughs> Tex loves his fur. <laughs> Not cloud. I can probably get over the mountain before it gets dark. Somebody's coming. Oh no. It seems like you get like story missions too just by doing these delivery things. Aren't you? You lied to me. Why did you do it? Why did you kidnap the princess? Don't jump to conclusions. I asked them to do it. You have a problem with that? Princess, do you know how worried I was? The tears I shed for you would have overrun the banks of the Yellow River. Why don't you give me that? Just why are you here? I was guided by fate. When two people are in love, they can always find each other. Who is in love? I told you a long time ago that I detest you. Just talking to you gives me goosebumps. Go home already. Princess, how can you say that? There's no one who loves you as much as I do. Sorry to bet I didn't like that, but that girl is saying to go away. So run along now. I understand now. You have somehow deceived my princess. What? What are you talking about? Princess, I'll defeat these vagabonds and free you from their control. I'd rather you did something about yourself first. You have to kick his ass. No. <laughs> it's a weird order, but sure. Alright. Yeah, let's make that. We can save the beginning of the fight, so I don't have to redo the cutscenes. Not like I'll die or anything, but. Just Sanzo Bean. <laughs> I wonder if where that's got the that's where they got the sensu bean thing from. Cause I mean, obviously Dragon Ball was also based on like loosely on very loosely on the whole uh, journey to the West thing. Yeah, you know, especially Goku. <laughs> yeah, that's where they came up with sensu bean. <laughs> sensu bean. <clears throat> Alright, do we want to wear change with her? Who do I want to wear change? Let me try, like, yeah, uh, I haven't tried, like, Lady Kika yet, her wear change. Spear thrust. Of these tall cliffs. Teleport beside this guy. speed is like zero. <laughs> Great angle for that wear change. <laughs> Thanks game. I can see everything. Head patty mode. <laughs> it's the wrong direction there. The hell, Sanzo's the slowest now.
Um, physical attacks, throw spell points. Yeah, we got that new one now. Strength roll, strength and physical defense, go. Of course, they always go for Sanzo. Because, of course, they do. <laughs> they love Sanzo. She get uh, briar brambles, which grow slash the enemy. Pop the wings that causes whirlwinds. Range three, area one. Range zero, so just around her, I guess. No, well, not near anybody. One dude by attacking. No, it can't even. <laughs> no, it sucks. <laughs> can't hit anything. I'm a butterfly. damage left. I wonder if we can kill him off. Kill this guy off. Hey, BPN. How's it going? How's the road rash horror? <laughs> How's that coming along? Ugh, that game... I'm happy I don't have to play games like that in <laughs> RPG Quest. That would be hell. Exact damage, unless he resists some of it. Look at that. Exact damage. <laughs> he should swap games. No, that's that's okay. As much as as much as I love playing, you know, Road Rash. <clears throat> that game just looks like an R like an RNG nightmare. <laughs> Try that charm thing here. Wind charm. 
Aw, oh, come on. Really? That's... Uh, I'm too high. I'll hit, like, three of them. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Everybody's playing shitty games right now. <laughs> games that just are horribly... RNG heavy. Got BPN playing some Road Rash. Got Sharpie playing uh, Space Hair Ear. <laughs> I'm happy I'm actually playing a good game. This is one of us. <laughs> exactly. Get all the enjoyable games. All the fun stuff. Just enough damage to kill him. Uh, let's protect my back a bit here. As far as he's attacking Cho and not uh, Sanzo. Let's go to Nuke of some kind. Missed me. Ow. It's crits. <clears throat> Alright, let's kill this guy here. Backstab him. Uh, of course, there's a number of enemies. Double peers. No. I think that's going to do more damage than normal. <laughs> hey, Sharpie. It's the tainted challenge. Yeah, you know, I had some shit stuff recently. I had um, Digimon World 2 was was a fun one. Dark Angel Vampire Apocalypse. Uh, I mean, La Pern w Pern was special. <laughs> it wasn't that bad of a game, but it wasn't much of an RPG. But basically, the upcoming stuff all seems good for the most part. So, except for you know, there's another Digimon game. Who knows how that's gonna be? This game. Oh. The presentation of this game is fantastic. It just looks good. Rayorin, what are you doing? I'm your husband-to-be. <laughs> it's perfect. I didn't realize she's the one who attacked him first. Who is my husband-to-be? You don't have to be embarrassed, but you're fated. I feel like you don't get the picture even if they're told. <clears throat> Kick him in the ass. Oh. <laughs> thought she got buffed there. No, she's just... It's always weird when the uh, your your buffs expire. It feels like you're getting buffed. It doesn't feel like you're getting debuffed. Yeah, okay, I need to jump down, I guess. Uh, let's just nuke these guys from up here. Pew pew. So it goes like a bad. I, I got my fair share of crappy gains, but at, at least at this uh, at this point on, I mean, from this era on, I should say, there's, there's not a lot of crap. I mean, there's some games that probably are not as good, but <laughs> most of the crap was done with in the earlier generations, especially the Amiga CD32. That was that was that was the worst one by far. It's kind of hard to beat that console. Just utter jank. Eight damage, water blade, 61, I'll do it. He's got a lot of health. <clears throat> Aha, debuff. I forget what that does in terms of actual debuffs. Like, lowers the damage, or... I wonder if I can charm this guy. No, it's probably going to be too far. Um, what about these guys? What's the range on charm? Uh, area 2, so I should be able to hit both of these if I go over here. I wonder how likely it is to work. And it damages them too, so...
one charmed. And two charmed, nice. Hey Chandra. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Need to figure out what to to do with those. Yeah, some like sound effect things or something. Not the looking into doing that. I'm sure there's plenty of sound effects from games we played before that would be perfect. Um, hmm. These guys won't really get to move too far. <laughs> We're kind of blocking their path. Whatever. Spell. Or you're near. Oh, I guess they they fight each other, so that works. <laughs> he really doesn't like her, does he? Only a billion games. Just, just a few billion, that's all. Whiter him. I need to, need to make sure that she gets the killing blow on him. I'm sure it was probably a cool, like, story thing if, uh, conversation thing if I kill him. Heal her. She's getting low on health here. What a heal. Now let's uh, put her back to human form. We'll switch. Switch, uh, what's her name, into uh, dragon form. Do some more damage over there. Just pretty special effects. God, Cho is so slow. I need him like to get some. Not necessarily some speed, but just for, like a movement uh, increase thing. Summon Let's turn on these for a while. <laughs> Been off for a week, I don't remember most of the animations. Until I get sick of them again, then turn them off again. They are pretty to look at for a little bit. Summon Mother. It's so pretty. Have her change into her wear form.
Oh, let's just kill this guy off. Oh, let's give it, let's uh, have Butterfly Lady kill him. He's got enough XP. What level is he now? 16? Kill him. Should be able to. Even though I'm killing him from the front. That's right. Bow. <laughs> and she got a crit. I don't know if you get any extra experience for killing something. I think damage is all that matters. Level up. <laughs> All my stuff leveled up. Charm blade. Let's charm this guy. Doesn't have a very good chance of charming, but. Charm him by stabbing him with swords. No charm. It's not poison, that's like... <laughs> Apparently that was poison. <laughs> Looks like he hit me with an icicle or something. Alright, what do we got here? Dragon bite, tail bit single target is all we really need. Does Tail Whip hit everything around us? No, it's a line. Uh, I mean, I go here and hit both of them with Tail Whip. You definitely get a lot less experience when you attack stuff in wear form. You get the power increase, but you definitely lose out on the uh, on the experience front. This guy. Uh, I want to make sure she gets the killing blow. <laughs> she should. Just out of range. I think poison goes away after the fight, so... Some extra experience. Kill him, don't want to do that. Let's make strict speed. 
It's a long range stab. It's gonna be out of range. Pretty good. <laughs> Forgot she's got a pretty good range, so. Oh, come on. Well, he's back attack, so. It should be doing more than 52 damage, I hope. Do like 53 damage. Plus 10, nearby. I've never been insulted in my life. Just who do you think I am? <clears throat> I thought he was going to transform into something there for a second. Twenty eight bonus. Boo. What should we do with him? It's a volcano right there. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Let's just dump him in this river. In the, in the river. <laughs> in this river. It's like, that's not a river. We are in. I don't really mean that. He'll be okay. He's a turtle. He'll just float to the sea. Princess, you wound me. Ah. Just calm down. Calm down? My cherished princess is almost lost to me. Calm down? I don't understand. I would rather die than be torn from her again. Well, alright, but... Listen, your very existence gives me the creeps. Sanzo, you think so too, don't you? What? Tell him. Go ahead. Tell him. I don't want to piss off Riorin, but... Fine. Riorin, don't try to avoid it. Tell him you hate him and never want to see him again. Hey, that's a little harsh. True, but still harsh. Isn't, she, isn't that what she's been doing all this time? Princess, are you so determined to keep me away? Yes, I'll do anything to get you to leave me alone. I understand. Today I shall withdraw. <laughs> but tomorrow, I'll be back. But don't forget, Princess, your heart will be mine. I shall ponder on this. I look forward to our next meeting. Farewell. <clears throat> Help! Somebody do something about him. Well, let's just see what he comes up with. <laughs> you, just because it's not you he's after. That'd be more interesting if he was after you. need to have a cutscene every time you deliver something. It's like, woo, thanks for the package, now go back to your shit. Every time. <clears throat> a bit of extra money, although we got a lot of money from that fight too. And Turfan? Where's Turfan? What are these lost item things are? Like, do we have to go there and, like, find the item? Kind of curious. It's only a thousand bucks, but. I need to try to. Mrs. Chang recently moved here from Turfan. At Firetop, she was attacked and lost an article of her departed husband. She wants to go look for it. Doesn't seem like a. Doesn't seem like a lot of money to 
do a fight there, but hey, let's try it. Let's see if there's anything we can upgrade. <clears throat> um... Who has what? <clears throat> All right. Chaos cap, I'm pretty sure, is better than the other things. Noble clothes, imperial armor, noble clothes. I think actually, if we buy it, it'll tell us when we choose to buy it. But more correctly, we'll come up with who wants to use it, kind of thing. Downgrade. Double hat. Slight upgrade for him, him, and her. Nose cap. She can use. <clears throat> so we can get a couple of noble hats. The clothes. Grades for all three of them. And noble clothes are better in scale mail. Oop, nope, shit. It's the wrong button. <laughs> Armor back on. Go. <laughs> she have her specials again. Uh, strength. Offense on one character. Hmm. It's fire based, but. <clears throat> Give it to him since he's got enough firepower to use it. I doubt Goku will be casting it too often. Now let's give it to Gojo. Seems kind of like a buffing kind of character, too. Scale Okay. I don't think there's anything we want to buy at the Smith. That uh, potion we had was it a one-time use potion? Yeah, plus two speed. Um, give that to. Give that to Hakai. It's pretty slow. Maybe, maybe Sanzo, because I mean, she's kind of a healer. Kick out in Sanzo. Maybe kick you. The faster she goes, the better.
Alright, let's go see what that lost item thing is. Fire top. So I wonder if it's just like a walk in there and you find the item or you actually have to do a fight. I'm assuming you have to do a fight. <laughs> for a thousand bucks, not really worth it, but I guess for extra experience and I guess wear points, really. Because you can get extra XP by going to the dojo, but you don't get wear points because you can't use wear form. So these ones here be the only way of getting wear points without doing the main story quest. It's not here. <clears throat> no, it's not. It's probably in the lava. <laughs> I don't see it. <clears throat> hey! Over here! It's pretty dirty. It may not be much to us, but to her it's very precious. She truly loved her husband, didn't she? We are in. She get married too. To who? Prince Raiken? I was feeling so romantic until you said that. I was kidding. Okay, so you don't actually do a fight. You just like go there, get a little bit of story, and... unless we fight something on the way back. Nope. Alright, so, I mean, maybe there's chances of getting story, but... You do seem to get some story stuff when you do these, so... It's kind of worth doing, I guess. <laughs> but I already got everything I needed to get uh, from that from that gambling place. I'm sure the next time I, I find a card place, I'll definitely be gambling again, but... <laughs> there's nothing left to get. Infidel. Let's go to Infidel. Another fight here. Let's see if this one's story based. If I get like non story based stuff, I'll just move on. Or anything that looks like it's story based. <laughs> it's just like, oh, here's the monster, it's fight. Sanzo, wait a minute. What's wrong, Goku? I feel someone watching us. A monster. Aren't we all monsters? <laughs> it's just like random monsters. <laughs> Where'd those ones come from? Triple exclamation marks! See, I told you. Yeah, the music in this game isn't bad. I mean, the artwork is, of course, the, the best part. Looks so good. Does that seem like a random encounter? Like, there was no... No special, like... Encounter thing. <clears throat> and... Uh, let the battle begin! Defeat all enemies! Fight! Goku to the middle of those dudes over there. Mode. Lightning clips. Go, go, Nimbus, go!
Spindle Hearts. Yeah, it's got that. It's got that very small kind of arena style thing. It's not like a big vast area like some other games. You know, the wear system is uh, an interesting addition. I mean, the actual gameplay itself is is nothing special really, but it's a lot of fun though. Presentation definitely uh, is the best part of this. Actual look of everything. Looks so good. You know, the crit really did any damage. Sexy, sexy warrior. <clears throat> Cardia, yeah. A lot of dudes down there. them. Hey, Van. How's it going? I mean, all the PS1 strategy RPGs or tactical RPGs basically look <laughs> very similar. This one was definitely a huge console for tactical RPGs. Nice North America. I mean, we had nothing up to this point other than Shining Force. <laughs> Let's fix charm this guy. No charm. Boom. Sega franchise, yeah. yeah. Shining Force. <laughs> Shining Force is pretty much the only like tactical RPGs we had stateside until the PlayStation 1. <clears throat> we had yeah, Shining Force 1, 2, and 3. Well, 2, I guess. 3 would have come out around the PlayStation time. Um, we had Langerisser 1, aka Warsong. And we had uh, Ogre Battle on the SNES. I think that's basically it. We had very little stateside. And in PS1 we got like it's like six of them or seven of them. Like there's so many strategy RPGs, tactical RPGs on the, uh, on the PS1. You got like the Vandal Heart games, you got Vanguard Bandits, you got uh, Final Fantasy Tactics obviously, you got this game, you got Hoshigami, Cardia, uh, Ogre Battle Tactics Ogre. Name a few. <laughs> I mean there's, there's a lot that got released on PS1. Let's go 
weird eyeball that whips them. These guys just want to get murdered, don't they? Of course, that guy goes out of the way. I'm gonna turn off those animations there that's starting to get <laughs> repetitive. Fish were a simple spell. <laughs> it's a long cast time. Healer. Get rid of him. God, I wish I had an AoE down over there. Everybody's missing. I figure if it's a way of hitting all three of those, but if I could move here, I could. <laughs> no, I couldn't. I did have to move here just to hit this guy. And of course, this guy would be too far at that point. And six to both of those. 106 to both of those. I guess this can stun them. Let's do that. <coughs> Or, you know, not stun them. That works too. nice if we could charm one of these guys, especially the healer. We have two healers here, so no healer. Hey, Fascinate. It's going well. Making some good progress, slowly but surely. This game is a lot of fun. It's one of those games that just has, like, great style. The gameplay itself is, you know, nothing to... Nothing to write home about or anything, but it's definitely very, it's a, it's a very um, competent tactical RPG with like a fantastic style. It's definitely a, an A-plus in my books. Let's move him towards these guys, so I need more help down there. These guys have a lot of hit points too, which is kind of annoying. I need an AoE spell here. Arr, I don't have any AoE spells. Alright, let's summon... Um, yeah, this one here is like an AoE. Healers now. Arr, this is gonna suck. Need to switch out uh, Goku here. For... Hey, 
Thanks for the host, Sharpie. Alright, let's switch him out of... Have him switch into it. We need all the help we can get over here. It's a lot of dudes. Can I not heal him? Because I can't heal them with their rare form? Hmm. I did not know that was a thing. Does that heal him? No, it doesn't. I, don't know, I just learned something new. I guess you can't heal when you're in rare form. <laughs> I don't think I ever tried, but... How far is the way is the west? I don't know. You know we started off in China, and we apparently left China in Chapter 1, at the end of Chapter 1. And we're, we're heading to India. And I don't know where we are now relative to India, but... Can't take that long to get to India. <laughs> so, I don't know. I, it's, it's hard to tell how many chapters this one's going to have. I'm, I'm thinking five. Five is usually standard for a lot of tactical RPGs. But... Who knows how, how long the chapter is going to be. We're making our way there, slowly but surely. Uh, okay, let's, I really need to uh, try to kill one, or to, to charm one of these guys, if I get lucky here. No luck. Boo. Kill this guy. I'm not really killing a lot of dudes here. <laughs> These guys are hard. It's fine. Show can take a beating. Alright. Flame whip. Two dudes here. How many wave hitting? One, two, eh? Nice that this guy is like right here. Exactly. Only we can fly. He's gonna die, isn't he? Before I even get the chance to uh, to use his special ability. Yep, <laughs> I'm dead. God damn it! There's too many dudes. hit him from here, can I? No. That's annoying. Can I hit him with a spell? Need to kill that guy. Needles. 63. Won't be enough. Spear thrust? No. Double pierce? No. That's too far. Well, that's annoying. not enough to finish him off. Uh, I wish I had an AoE. Let's do wear change with her. Just more damage here.
We need to kill that guy. I need to keep her here just so I don't so I have less chance of her getting killed. So let's uh ramble this guy we can. Finish him off. These healers are getting annoying, but Charm thing's gonna help here quite a bit actually since they're all gathering up like this. It should be illegal. It's the worst thing. Especially when they're all the way in the back and can't do anything about them. Damn. Oh, come on. <laughs> I guess I was attacking from the front so I couldn't finish them off. Alright, fireball. Damn it. Now if I attack her. It's a good thing there's no friendly fire in this. and possibly charm them. I wish I could just, like, jump right here. Oh, I can. So, wait. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully this charms a whole bunch of them. This is going to be amazing if it does. It seems like this is... This has got a pretty good chance of charming. So far, we're two for two. As long as we can charm the healers. Nope. <laughs> Can't charm the healers, apparently. Hmm. Charmed one of them, which is really good. Hopefully he uses his heals on us. Of course, the two I didn't charm are the ones like <laughs> that have direct access to her. Gets out of range hit this guy, but, I mean, he's charmed. No, he's not charmed, actually. Let's finish him off. Flame whip this bastard. Wasting his time by healing. Oh, oh. Kill the one that's charmed. Whatever. <laughs> that healer heals us now. Thank you. Charming healers is best. <laughs> Got a range attack right now. Needles. Spell Fireball. <laughs> 
just a miss. Thank you. <clears throat> right. Let's go finish each other off. Rather, the healer's gonna heal us, and then... What a nice dude, healing us up like that. <laughs> so nice of him. Now let's murder him! Run. How's it going? All right, all we lost, all we lost was the fishman dude. <laughs> he got kind of surrounded. There's a lot more dudes than I expected down there. So. That was fun. Victory. Take a lot of turns though, so it's like, only took eight turns. I think I, I'm averaging on, I'm averaging eight turns now. Pretty able to learn fire dance. <clears throat> Killing these guys like quickly be hard. <clears throat> I mean, the the best bet would have been to send uh, Goku over those big groups of enemies and nuke them like crazy. Goku, how'd you know? That was great. Heh <laughs> I know. It's hot here. Can we get going? You're dead. Go Gojo, shut up. Yes, let's go. We're heading to Infidel, right? To turn in this thing. <laughs> cloudy, cloudy, cloudy. <clears throat> I wonder if they're going to have something different. <laughs> I'm going to skip these cutscenes, basically, and they're going to say something important. I won't notice. <clears throat> 2500 bucks! Rich! New Ooh, 3400 bucks. I gotta do that one. I'll be rich. Maybe we'll get lucky and not get an encounter. Probably not, but <clears throat> either way, we'll get some experience. Some more wear experience. Should be good enough after that. We'll move on. This is another deliver one, or another deliver find an object one. This looks like we could probably be different. Alright, let's see if we get anything different now, or it's the same thing as last time, where it's like, oh, there's somebody coming! Yeah, seems like the same thing. So we're getting the same encounter thing. <clears throat> exact same group of enemies, too. Now well, we know what we're gonna do this time. <laughs> Sanzo back here. Goku as close as we can to those guys. Show. Show's so slow. Her over here. Here, she can help kill these guys. Gojo over here. Good.
Goku some strength. <clears throat> what? It's direct, like, you have to be right beside the enemy. It's kind of annoying. Defense up. help these guys out. Oh. Concentrate on one till they're dead. Never charm. Yeah, you can't charm any, uh, or you can't do buffs or heal anybody who's in wear form. I don't know if they keep any buffs when they change into wear form, if they lose all those buffs. Definitely can't charm them after the fact. likes Gojo, do they? <laughs> Comes the healers. Fire. What's the range on this? Three? That was two numbs enemies. Let's see. This is a pretty good damage. What's the uh, cost in this one? Four, right? So I can do one of those and then one of these, but let's start off with this one just so we can numb all these guys. If, if it works. Paralysis is best. <laughs> Nice. All we need to do is charm the uh, <laughs> charm the healer, and we're good.
Ah, uh, dodged. Bastard. Use my break attack. I don't like Kojo. I'm surprised they're not going for a Sanzo, though. It's a rarity. Fire dance. It's not a dance. <laughs> it's like fucking meteor. Surprise, he's healing himself. <laughs> run, run, you fool! These guys are flying too, which is annoying. They can go places I can't. What the hell was that? I need to kill this freaking healer before he does anything. See, I better get a good bonus from attacking from that high up. Wear change here, I can damage those two guys. Yeah, let's do that. 
I'll go right back to human form afterwards. <laughs> it's a very long lasting war change, but. Charm. Never lucky. Plus, we're doing less damage than, than he can take, so. so. Less damage than he can heal, so he's just gonna keep healing. Stay out of range. <laughs> uh, I need some area of attack spells with her. Summon Mother for now. Give everybody up a bit. <clears throat> really want to kill Jojo. Dodged me. Come on, Charm Blade. Charm the healer. Yes. These healers are annoying. <laughs> They'll do like more than 88 damage a turn or even make a dent or charm them. Not the charm's gonna last forever or anything, but. Really? You didn't heal us? <laughs> healer off here. He's out of mana anyways. Should have some extra nice damage there. Stead. Kill him. What a spell, Water Blade. He's weak to it, so that should be enough to kill him, I think.
Let's get some extra XP here. These guys are so far from the action now. Charm? Boo. It's the healers on our side, so there is that. Thank you. Haven't wasted all his mana on healing us. <laughs> Go zoom zoom. I don't have any AoE, do I? That's what I really need is more AoE attacks. Like non. non um, wear form AoE attacks. Right now I only have Fireball, I think. are just so slow. Like they're basically out of the uh, game for now. Stealing my XP. I'm here, you, sir. This charm is off. Just in time. <laughs> He's out of mana, anyways. Otherwise, probably would have healed us. Oh, he's got plenty of mana. Oh, we got. We'll be able to kill him before he uh, acts again, at least. Eight turns, so oh, nine turns this time. <laughs> Slower than last time, somehow. All right, enough trips here. Uh, where are we going? <laughs> Is it Infidel or Biku? Turfan, I think it was. Wait, what? More encounters? Yeah, this is why this one was worth like 3,000 bucks. <laughs> or maybe we have to deliver it here. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I guess it just automatically happens when you stop or you pass by the place.
Alright, just grab that money and then move on. We've got plenty of money for the uh, next town, I guess. any more, like, hmm, negotiations item. Well, guess we're gonna try that one. The jewel cup was stolen from Master Zhang's place. Thieves demand 30,000 gold in exchange. I'd like you to take the money and go get the cup back. Couldn't we just, like, take the money and run? <laughs> I feel good when you get paid. Will you do it? Sure. Anytime we get like these weird, like just non delivery ones. Garden Lake. Which one's the Garden Lake? Oh, okay, it's a new area. <laughs> so that, that especially too, it opens up a new area. Which means potentially new loot. Have to be careful in time they offer re or any sort of jobs there. I got to keep an eye for special ones like that. <laughs> well, I mean, it's, it's probably implied that everybody's attacking at once, but obviously, you know, that'd be a little bit hectic if you controlled everybody at the same time. You'd be playing an RTS at that point. So closest thing they could do is just make it so it's just like a, it's, like, it's like standard JRPGs right where you're, you've got turn based attack you know like all your guys aren't attacking one at a time it's just it's implied that everybody's attacking once but that's the best way to make it work what would be cooler is if because I think some games do this too is that you choose all of your attacks and then and then the round happens where everybody moves at once <laughs> Finally. The problem with that is the enemies would also move, so you have to kind of predict their movement. So that's a lot trickier. Hurry up and hand over the money. Alright, I'll be right back. Stop. What? We'll decide who brings it. Little girl in purple. Have her bring it. Me? Yeah, you. Fine with me. Little girl in purple. Don't you think that's kind of cruel? Look <laughs> at undercooked meatballs. Yeah. Yeah, the ATB system. That's one way of doing it, but... I mean, it's kind of unrealistic, too. <laughs> okay, now give me the cup. What? We are in. How dare they backstab her? Okay, she's our hostage. You want her back? Give us another 10,000 gold. Huh? Don't be crazy. What are you talking about? Shut up. If you don't get us the money, she's dead. Yep. Now. <laughs> you cowards, how dare you hit me? Kick, her, kick their ass, Rioran. You got this. Got murdered for your insolence. <laughs> Yeah, don't piss off Riorin. She's a Dargon. Battle start. Alright, perfect spot right here to convert into a Dargon. For a change, go! Like, oh shit, we made a mistake! She's not a little girl at all. A big snake lady. Ah, 
I know, right? She's worth at least a hundred thousand. Yep. <laughs> Went the wrong direction there, but whatever. I can not enough damage though. Probably finish on the th um... show won't be able to, but uh, let's get some rock shield going on, Gojo. Hey Dragon Soul. Rambles. It's become terrifying. It's indeed very terrifying. Okay, tilt whip, range two, line three. Dragon bite, invade. Blade does the most damage. Six goes weak to that move. <laughs> Gotta check behind these trees too for uh, items. There's a lot of trees. <laughs> I have to like convert out of wear form. Like right between those trees, try try to like position my character is just the perfect way to kill as many trees as possible. I can get somebody here. I can kill these three trees, changing to wear form. Nice if there's a guardian that like raised wear points. <laughs>
kill all but one, then try to kill these trees. So I got four wear form, or five wear form things here. One chest. Double close. Not sure if it's gonna be anything good, but gotta check. <laughs> These two here are going to take like two individual ones. So I can kill. So let's see, it's going to need one, two. Yeah, and I can be able to kill every single tree. So I can kill three here with just one wear form change. This one, I'm another one. So, so one, two. Question is, which one do I want to leave? <laughs> I wish I could just like hit these things, just destroy the tree. Can I use like a spell or anything? Nope. Can't even use a spell. Save after we kill the uh, the other ones. Turn position. I wish you could, like, I'll have to save just to, just to make sure I don't miss any potential treasure here. Because probably, you know, I'll be able to kill all but one tree. It's bad, from this position, it looks like those two trees are side by side. <laughs> I would add just enough. Okay, they really don't like her, do they? Get her to kill these two right now. Right, let's make a save first. Well, either way, I'm gonna kill the like the, the doubles. Just there. Yeah, apparently. Very surprising. Let's just do a little bit of get a little bit of XP. <laughs> Maybe I'll level up with five XP. Whip scroll. That sounds good.
battle save here. <clears throat> so the question is, which one of these trees is not going to have anything in it? <laughs> Let's see if this one here happens to be one of them. That one has something. Is it two trees or three trees? How many? How many more transforms do I have? I think I have three. And there's four additional trees. Yeah, we have these four individual trees. I won't be able to. This one, these three, I'll be able to kill in one shot. So yeah, it's two trees I'm gonna have to leave alive here. Find out which ones don't have anything. So that one we can leave alone. the big grove of three trees doesn't have anything, but the odds are at least one of them has something. We can ignore those three. <laughs> Surprising none of those three had anything. Let's just open that one tree that had something. What do you want? <laughs> so annoying. You're so annoying. Yes, you are. There's no snacks. So we have two more potential trees, these two. Can change out. Grab this one. 
magic potion. Eh. Okay, I want to kill that guy. Uh, I shouldn't be able to kill him anyways. For a change here. Nothing here. So maybe that one next to... Next to Cho. She is indeed looking for pants. Square attack this one. This last tree left, anyways. I just killed the tree with another tree. <laughs> it's pretty impressive. Alright, let's get all this stuff. There's no like secret hidden ones or anything anywhere. Trish is hiding behind here. I'm curious what that rose whip thing is. an awful group of people. I'm glad our jeweled cup is safe. Things would have been really bad if we had broken it. Hey, what's just more important? Me or that cup? Don't make me answer that. Why, the answer is obvious. Where you are in? You two idiots. In this case, we'll have to agree with her. True. Master Gojo, Lady Kika. Alright. Yeah, I wonder where the item is we're gonna get there. Uh, let's check that thing we got, though. The Rose Whip thing. Whip numb. That's good. I need a numbing thing. Should I give it to Sanzo? No, Sanzo's already got a bunch of stuff. Let's give it to um, Chicken Cheese. I think I need a pretty good amount of uh, plant. And she's not high enough to use it. I guess it's going to turn the sands off for now. Needs. Uh, where do I see how much it needs here? Let me see.
Oh, there, 17. No, wait, 17 is my current one. How much does it need? between 11 and 18, <laughs> whatever it was. So numb is gonna be really useful against some of those annoying like, enemies, like especially the healers and stuff like that. <clears throat> Paralyzed enemies. What's the kind of bonus we get on top of that? <clears throat> this feels like so much more quality. The load times are a lot faster. <laughs> I love the art style. The art style is just perfect. Like just the just number of like various portraits for the characters where you know you can see their emotions whenever they're, you know, talking. It's great. It's perfect artwork. A torrent belt. Seeing it's some sort of water based thing. Means only for him. Mo movement plus six. That would make sense. If he can move an extra six slots, that'd be amazing. But I'm assuming he can only, only he can use it. like a moving plus six in water or something. Doesn't say that though. Let's see, is there a Let me go to item I guess under party info. Yeah, item info. Oh yeah, you go. this one needs life level fifteen. This is your spell. Okay, magic offense plus six. <clears throat> That's pretty good, though. I mean, it's only he can, only he can use it, so. <laughs> more water spells. This more water blade will be uh, even better, I guess. Alright. Any more cool things in here? Just delivery stuff. Good enough now. We got 17,000 bucks. <laughs> we'll be able to buy a lot of stuff by the time we hit the next town that has a. Can't see what these things have. I'm assuming Tokahara is probably the next town that has shops and stuff. This can take two, bran two branching paths, so. The other ones have. I forget what they had. Did they had shops? They might have had, like, chemists. I think that's all they had. Chemists and dojos. Alright, let's go to Plateau Mountain. Oh, 
That's a lot of rocks that we can bust open. Can young girls live here alone for eight days? Yeah, we're trying to rescue some girls, aren't we? <laughs> Stop it, you're implying they're already dead. Yeah, there's a lot of dead children in this game. That's rated E. <laughs> as long as they don't meet up with monsters, they should be able to survive here. If they meet up with a monster? Stop it, don't... It doesn't do any good to think like that. We should try to find somewhere safe from storms. They'll be in a place like that. Wait, do you hear something? Nope, don't hear nothing. It's your imagination. It's a big dude. Ooga booga ug er. <laughs> a monster. This must be the one they were talking about. This thing got them. The girls didn't have a chance. We'll take care of that thing now, so it can't hurt anyone any more kids. Ooga booga. <laughs> Zim bam boom. Alright, it's so got a lot of those rocks we need to bust open for potential treasure. Her in the middle. efficient with our transformations here. One of this is considered, yeah, so I think it has a lightning bolt. It means we can break it open, potential treasure. So this will, there's a lot of freaking rocks here. This is a lot of potential treasures. In terms of efficiency, we can break these two at the same time. We can break these three at the same time, or these three, it doesn't matter which one. I, yeah, let's break can break these three and then can break these two. Um, break these three at the same time. These three at the same time. Uh, these three at the same time. Break these two at the same time. Yeah. So we should be able to efficiently destroy as many rocks as we can here. Okay, so King Kaku, when King Kaku dies, that's it. Get time to use that uh, paralysis thing. Let's make a save. This looks like uh, looks like Goku's in the perfect spot to use his change here just to destroy these three rocks. So we'll have him do the first one. Silver necklace. The range sucks on this one. Some extra defense up. 
One second, Dino. One second, I'll get you down. I'll get you down. One second, one second. All right, go. Blade <clears throat> start. Ow. It's getting your ass kicked here. QJOE here. Whatever he's using. Shit. <laughs> That's dangerous as fuck. <laughs> Those nails. Man, I need... <laughs> okay, well, if I can if I use Howl here, it's gonna destroy some of these rocks too, so you win-win here. So I'll destroy like all these rocks. So it's potentially I'm one of them. Did it? Oh, you're right, yeah. I didn't even notice. <laughs> I've played all the Vandal Hearts at this point. <laughs> Vandal Hearts 1 and 2. Let's pick and charm one of these guys. This one has a very low chance of charming, I've noticed. Fortunate thing. Whip is an area one, range one, so let's look at those two guys. I am in doubt the bosses uh, can be um but the boss can be uh numbed, but these guys might I don't know what the odds are. Huh? Numb him at least. I want to make sure I don't want to kill the boss before I get all these rocks, but... Riorin's probably dead here. <laughs> Goes right for Riorin. Riorin's totally dead. Oh well. Good thing there's no permadeath in this. <laughs> 53 damage now. We are in now! Okay, let's see what we got for rocks here. Still have those two rocks down there. But I have all these rocks over here now. Could probably...
if I go here, do a fire dance right here. Oh, converted all but those three rocks. Problem is, at that point, I won't have enough wear points to do anything else. Uh, boulder dance. We'll kill those two rocks. Let's kill these two rocks. No, I need to. change out here. Let's do where change here. Those two rocks. Oh, treasure there. We need to heal. I'd be able to throw group heal right here, but and nobody's really that hurt, so. Should kill this guy. Back damage. Hey Ridge, how's it going? Yeah, the Tactics Ogre is pretty good. I recommend that one too. Most of the PS1 Tactic games were good. Star throw? It's gonna hurt, isn't it? Just got up. I love sleeping in. It's the best. Alright, we got... Uh, okay, so... We got four more wear uses here. So I can... Destroy those two rocks with one. Uh, these three with one over here. And then one over here. That should be enough to eat everything. Finish off these guys. Keep the boss alive. It's not gonna be easy, but thing. Charm blade. If I get lucky, the boss will destroy some of these rocks here.
or 300? Nice. <laughs> you and me both. The best addiction. Okay, let's do wear form over here. I could have done right in... No, I couldn't have done it. I was going to say I could have done it in front of those guys, but... Let's grab this. A golden comb. Yeah, we got a silver necklace last time, too. I think. We got to see what that is. I don't know why I used the charm there. <laughs> it killed him anyways. Since you can't Zelda Souls, Metroidvanias, yeah. <laughs> He's almost dead. I could probably finish him off with an attack. Can. And then some. can reach that spot? No. I can use a wear ability here. Try to kill these three things. Do I have anything that's, that uses two points? Oops. Boulder Bash is two. I won't kill all three of them. Howl. Can I position Howl? Would kill all three of those boulders? No. position like right here. <laughs> oh shit, no. Ah, I didn't mean to do that. No. God, I hope there's no chest in that last one. Too late now. Fancy 7 Remake isn't a remake? Sure it is. It's totally a remake. It makes the game completely. So completely, it's not even the same game. Plus potion. Alright, that's the boss left now. Other than the one we can't get. Boss could uh, destroy that rock if we like gather everybody around it. Like the potential thing. Yeah, let's just hope there's nothing in there. That's all. <laughs> let's hope for the best. Transform him back to normal. I guess that's a little girl, probably. She looks like a little girl that would have transformed to a monster. Humph! 
What? A girl? We beat up a little girl. Hooray! Bronze Dragon learned wind scales. Numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Xena Gear, Xena Cycle 1, 2, 3, Every Breath of Fire, Lufia 1, 2, Carcetti 1, 2. What about third birthday? <laughs> yeah, it's not an RPG. It's on my list, but yeah, it's, I'm only including it because Parasite Eve. But here I scream. Buy her candy. Hey, changed into... What? This couldn't be one of the missing children, could it? Don't be frightened. Hurry, kill her before she trains his back. Ah. Great. Are you alright? Hey, I'm back. I'm back. What happened? That's what we'd like to know. Who are you? How long have you been here? I'm So Kinray. I've been here for about eight days, I guess. What's going on? The kids were looking... We were looking for a human, right? I am human. Even if I did turn into that. I tried to talk, but no one understood. I don't know what to do. What happened? Did someone do something to you? I was playing with Ginray, and we found this large gourd. We opened it, and there was a sweet smelling water inside it, so we tasted it. That's when our bodies got bigger. <laughs> As a gourd full of filled with Viagra. Sanzo, these kids, they've changed. They're where now? What? Can we cure them? There is no cure. That can't be. Oh yeah, we helped Genray too. She won't come out of the cave where we found that gourd. Okay, come on everyone, let's get going. Art be all. RPGs, RPGs for life, man. RPGs for life. They're the best. <laughs> yeah, keep going. <laughs> chop, chop. Why don't we go right into this quest? Gin raids me. Come over here. Don't be afraid. I'm telling you, you'll, you'll be fine. Yeah, whatever. Still, why are there monsters around her? I don't know. They just showed up. Maybe they wanted the gourd. Good old gold and silver. Kinnengin. Well, we're gonna have to grab her then. Wait, you'll scare Henry. What's going on? Uh -oh. oh, she's dead now. <laughs> GG. What kind of gourd is that? Grr. <laughs> Thing made her angry. I'm gonna have to use force. Watch out for the gourd. Eh, they're all together, it doesn't really matter where we put them. <clears throat> Let's make a save. Hopefully we don't keep her health from the previous fight. Any points of interest to, to blow up here? Defeat Ginkaku. Bottle. Nice. 
So nothing that... So we just go all over their wear here. She's got a pretty good, like, AoE attack, so let's use her wear change here. Plus, she can fly, so that helps a lot. <laughs> These big platforms. Willow is one of those games that I didn't expect much out of it. Because, you know, it's like, oh, it's, it's, a, it's a game based on a, you know, on a show. It's got to suck. But it was actually quite a bit of fun. Definitely an impressive game for the, uh, for the NES era. That one on the side of the gourd is controlling it. If we defeat that one, then at least we won't be sucked up into the gourd. Wait, we can get sucked up in the gourd? <laughs> Alright, we've got to get rid of that gourd. Dude, ASAP. So we have to send, uh... Send, uh, Goku over there with Cloud. Great, that's gonna hit everybody, isn't it? Everybody's highlighting there. What the hell? <laughs> that's not an attack. What kind of bullshit attack is that? <laughs> like literally firing a big ass laser at us. No oh, bullshit on that one. You'll be... You'll be the next to be sucked in. Thank you. I'll kill you before I get sucked in. Ring. That's pretty good damage. are pretty strong against it. It's not fair. Snipe these guys. Pretty other stories. I mean, there's technically a remake of the original Radio Authorities, but more of an enhanced version. I don't know if that counts.
I haven't played it yet myself. I haven't played too much of anything in the DS era. Most of my RPG play, uh, playing time was PS2 era. Although, obviously, with RPG Quest at this point, I've played everything up to uh, up to 2001 now. So I've played the entirety of the PS1 library now and, and later. But anything later than that was pretty much PS2 back in the day. Ow. Use a three of them. If I go here, I can hit all four of these guys. Does that hit? No, it doesn't hit him, is it? <laughs> That's one thing I haven't really played a lot of the uh, Dragon Warriors on the, uh, the portables. And those things are freaking expensive to collect for, too. Crazy. I think they've been popular enough that, you know, it'd be easy to collect from them. Alright, let's just rake. Here I can use bramble, not bramble, uh, rose whip on these you guys right here. Ah, not enough to kill her, but at least I stun her. Is everything so close to death? It sucks. Alright, kill her off. Nobody got sucked into the gourd, I guess that's a good thing. I have no AoE spells, do I? Mm. Only 20 plus. <laughs> you'll get there, you'll get there. RPGs are definitely a big time investment too. It's one of those things that you kind of have to... 
definitely have to like put aside time to do it. Uh, let's kill this guy off, so we don't have to worry about him. Backlogs are the worst. <laughs> Big open world games are the <laughs> those are the hardest ones to kind of like finish. There's just too many of them. I wonder if I actually can I, can I, can I use this? Let's see. I can't <laughs> just like use it to suck Kinako in or something, or Ginaku or whatever the name is. down. How many years, how many different versions of uh, Skyrim is there now? Like 50, 60? <laughs> There's Skyrim for everything. You know they're going to release another one for like the, the next generation. You know they're going to have like a Skyrim... At least on the Xbox, for sure, because, you know, Microsoft owns uh, owns them now, but you know they're going to release another one. At last, I'm out. I'm kind of tired. Hooray. Five turns, well. Finish that one pretty quick. Especially considering we like went to kill everything. Oh, we got ten now. <laughs> River Lord does learn Dark Hole. You, you don't want to see River Lord's Dark Hole. Tom Kong's a girl. <laughs> I chose the girl version. You get you get to choose uh, for Sansa. You get to choose male or female. Of course, I went for the female version. Maybe we got like an even team. Three females, three males. Kinray, Kinray. Uh, she's awake. This one's fine too. Kinray, I'm so relieved. Are you okay? Kinray? How did we change back? I don't know, but isn't it great? Kinray, thanks. You destroying the gourd thing helped. I mean, helped. She didn't do nothing. <laughs> yeah, I was so worried about Gin. I had to do something. Just what was that gourd, I wonder? A gourd that dissolves anything it sucks in and changes it to magic wine. I guess those girls are wine now. <laughs> There's a number of hermits and magicians that like to make stuff like that. I'm still surprised this game is only rated E. There's like 
alcohol references. There is like the the, the, the murder of children in this game. There's like a, there's a, there's a quest where you had to like clean up the blood of a girl who committed suicide because her lover died or whatever. I mean, how is this a rated E game? This is this is one of those games the ESRB really did not look very well at. <laughs> There were hermits and magicians that like to make stuff like that. They hide what they made, but they keep on making new stuff and forget about the old. <laughs> for everyone loves alcohol. There's even gambling in this game, but we know how the SRB is on gambling. <laughs> Girls, by any chance did you open something? Say a door or a treasure box? Yeah, there was a strange door inside the mountain. Rain is falling hard, so we're trying to find shelter. Ah. Hey, let's head home. Mom's probably worried about us. No, I don't think I've ever tried Elder Scrolls Online. <laughs> just one of those things that just, like, eh. MMOs at this point just don't interest me. But we're... Doesn't matter. Let's go. I played enough EverQuest to last me, last me a lifetime back in the day, so... Alright, let's make a save. Alright, I'm gonna pause the time here for a second and take a quick bathroom break. I shall grab some... I'm gonna warm up some food real quick, too. So I'll be back in about uh, two minutes. <laughs> 